Gene amplification can be done artificially by using polymerase chain reaction technique. Thus, PCR is in vitro technique of gene amplification. It was first developed in 1983 by Carey Mullis. In 1993, Mullis was awarded the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for this work. The requirements of PCR are a DNA segment to be amplified, forward and reversed primers, all four types of deoxyribonucleotide that is DATP, DCTP, DGTP and DTTP. Apart from all this, a thermostable DNA polymerase isolated from Thermus aquaticus also called as TAC polymerase is required. The process of PCR consists of three steps. First is heat denaturation. This step involves heating of DNA at about 91 degrees Celsius. The heating breaks the hydrogen bonds to make single standard DNA. The DNA molecule with more GC pairs need high temperature. Second step is annealing. It is pairing of primers to the single standard DNA segment. The primer have to be designed as per the requirement. This step required a temperature of about 55 degrees Celsius. Third step is extension or polymerization. The temperature is raised to 72 degrees Celsius. The tag polymerase adds DNTPs behind the primer on the single standard DNA. These three steps constitute one cycle of the reaction. The process is carried out for about 20 to 30 cycles. Each cycle of PCR takes about 3 to 5 minutes. PCR technique is used in medical and biological research lab for a variety of application. It is used in DNA cloning, gene amplification, DNA based polygeny, diagnosis of hereditary diseases, DNA fingerprinting and diagnosis of infectious diseases and diagnosis of cancer. Thank you.